Well, well, well. We're back with another reacting video. And today, we are going to be reacting to five more horror short films. This time, I try to do better. I try to get some actual scary ones. The last time, I kind of missed the mark. But before I start, I did want to react to the Amanda the Adventure trailers with you guys real quick. I've been holding it up so I can react to it with you guys. There's two different trailers. So I'm going to go with the short one first. And then we're going to go with the longer one. Ooh, does it take place in a school? There's like a CD player. It doesn't look like a record player anymore. That's it. This is 22 seconds long. But this one looks like... It's like a little kid's library. Like a school library. Well, that one was super short. But here we are in the second one. Real quick. This was like more like a minute and 30 seconds long. Is it on? Oh, There's okay, Wooly. So, uh, hey... And we got a little chicken. It's me, Wooly. <laughs> Big man. Boy, is it sure has been a while, hasn't it? <clears throat> mm hmm. Let's go, well, Wooly. Uh, Start talking. Thank you so much for your support. Amanda. Oh. Amanda couldn't be here today. She's, uh, um. Well, she's out. Yeah. Cold. But, but don't worry, she gave me a special message to read to you all. All right. I just gotta. What is it? Gotta find. Ah, okay. Here it is. Hey, friends, it's Am Amanda. Oh. Sorry, I couldn't make it today. Been busy going on adventures and meeting up with old old, old friends. Old friends. Uh huh. But I just wanted to thank you for showing your love, and let you all. N no, that uh, Amanda loves you. Is she have bad handwriting or something? Uh, okay, I did what you asked. Now please oh. let me go. Oh, they caught Wooly. Who is that? Is that it? Who is that? Well, Wooly kind of threw him on the bus, saying um that I did what you asked and all that stuff. And then there was a dark little figure in there. Something's going on. Something's going on. So we still have. Five more videos to react to. And the first one we're going with is She Knows Horror Short Film by Spencer Keller. Posted three years ago, 2.6 million views. I thought the last one is like high quality. This one's high quality. The color grading looks like amazing. Oh! Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, he hit her for car. Oh, he don't want to go to jail. What is this like a I know what you did last summer type beat? No! Oh my god. He killed her. Rage and tolerance anger. It's what a lot of Americans are feeling across our nation right now. Right now is a moment we can Bruh, let's be honest. The whole nation of America would not like feel bad for one missing girl. Hey, That's man. just what's up life. I was just going to check in and see how you are. I'm alright. How about you? I'm good. I was just wondering where you put her. Oh. What? Where did you put her? How did... Did you joking? What do you mean? Where did you put her? Oh no, he's tripping. Where did you put her? Where did you put her? Where did you put her? His phone's haunted, bro. Ooh. Wash your hands. This man hit this 14 year old girl and just. Hit her. 
What a weirdo. Got some, got some fruit snacks. I actually don't like fruit snacks. Kind of playing. Oh, hex nah. Ew. Yo, what was that? I think it was like nine feet tall. Mm -mm. And he lives alone. Oh my god. How is he not waking up? How is he not... What did I just say right there? What did I have to say? Yo. That's loud. It wasn't even his room? <gasps> mm -mm. Mm -mm. I forgot to turn off my light to make it scarier. Yo. Nah. You play baseball, where's your bat? Where's your bat? Oh. Um, run, boy. Oh, there you go. I caught it. The door's open now. Um. <gasps> Yo. Oh my god. Mm -mm. That one was pretty good. I ain't gonna lie. That one was pretty good. What the freak monster was that though? Can you tell me that? Why was her head huge? And why was she so tall? All right, for a second one, we got Netflix and chill. You know what I mean? Netflix and chill. You know what I mean? All right, let's get into it. Got the milk? Got the cookies? We all know what happens when I make cookies. Dang, that's a lot of cookies, though. She got like 10. Oh, wait, she's waiting for someone. I feel like there's another coaster. Hello? Netflix and chill. Oh. I know. What do you think I'm watching right now? Are you gonna binge it all tonight? Who's she waiting um, for? Duh. What are you eating? Wait, don't tell me. Cookies, bro. Cookies? No. I'm on a diet, remember? What are you um. eating then? Um, sliced veggies. If you say so. What the? Well, what? I'm get back to the show. Talk later. Yeah, okay. There she got some magic Bye. powers. So you're eating cookies again. Will it change back? You wanted to lie, that's what you get. Didn't I just have... <laughs> I'm not passing that off. Has been a long day. No, your mind does not make you think you threw some oven, some cookies in the oven. You grab some freaking cookies and then all of a sudden you have veggies. What is, what is her logic right here? And anyway, she's waiting for someone, look at that coaster. They bought a Netflix inch. Oh, it's her boyfriend. Hey, can I come over? Not tonight? Why Why do you have a coaster then? I miss you too. I just want to be alone tonight. Are you mad at me? No. She's mad at him. My grandpa just passed. I need alone time. Oh, okay. I'm so sorry. Text me when you're feeling better. I will. Why does she have another coaster? Why is there two coasters if she doesn't... Seriously? Calm down, girl. Ignoring your mom? Oof. Hmm? 
Put your phone on like do not disturb, bruh. Let's be real. Hello. Erica, it's mom. Mom. Mm. You don't have to say it's you every time. Your number's saved in my phone. We've been over mm -hmm. this. Erica, I have some really bad news. Oh. It's your grandpa. He passed away. What? I'm so sorry, sweetie. It just happened. Huh? Can you come over? Right now? Yes. Your brother's already on his way. <sighs> Wait. I can't right now. Did you not hear me? Your grandpa's dead. Mom, I know, but I barely knew him, and it's late. Erica, you better come right now. Mom, I'm really sick, and she's about to be I've sick. Coughing. Every time she lies, it comes true. She just killed her grandpa. Let me get some rest, and if I'm feeling better, I'll head over first thing in the morning. Yo. Okay. Okay, mom. I'm sorry, but Good her night. mom don't sound like a mom. Is that rude? I'm sorry. Anyways. Bro. <sighs> she just lied about her grandpa dying and then he actually died. <laughs> now she's sick. <coughs> Do not like understand what's going on, lady. Tell yourself. Lie and say you're okay. What's going on though? Why is like 50 people <laughs> following Hello. her? Are you happy with your current internet service? Sorry, I, I actually can't talk right now. I have a really bad headache. <clears throat> Bro, why does she keep lying? Bro, this is her fault. <sighs> One, she's not smart enough to figure out what's going on. And this, why is she lying, bro? Hello? Did you say you were happy with your current internet Leave service? Leave me alone. You're giving me a brain aneurysm. Oh my gosh. You better have a brain aneurysm. Idiot. She deserves it. I'm sorry. Did she just die? She just died. She just died. She just died. She just died. She wants to lie, so she died. Great. <laughs> Great. That was a good one, though. I'm not gonna lie. We go third animation. And we got Midnight Snack Horror Animation. Kaboom Bang. This is an actual animation. Kind of giving, like, llama arts type thing. But not. Not the same art style. But it's not, like, real life acting. Honestly, I think animations do better. Going for a midnight snack in this type of weather is insane. Oh, he's homeless. He's trying to find somewhere to live. I mean, he needs to or he's literally going to die. It's a snowstorm. You can't be out there. Flashlight propped up right there perfectly for you. Now I'm leaving. That's suspect. Oh, he looks so jolly, though. Dang, that's a big building. Oh, okay. Oh, the door's locked. Why not just knock it down like you did with the front door? I like how you hear rustling, like, behind him, kind of. It's not, like, actually... <gasps> Don't go in there, man. A door opens two seconds after you try to open it. I'm not... Mm -mm. And there's a creepy doll. Why does that one look so realistic, though? Why does this scene look so realistic? Oh, there's family photo. Yo. Oh, he's hungry. Now nah, is a midnight snack, okay. Ooh. 
How's there flies in there? He's looking through everything. He's scavenging. Ah, oh, he's got a little bit hungry. Um. Hello? Who's munching in the corner? Bro, do not go up to that hole. You got me messed up. <gasps> Why are you just sticking your hand in there? Someone's gonna eat his hand. What is that? Is that like a dragon fruit? What is that? Oh, he's cooking it though. Why so floppy? Oh. God dang, he just ate a hole. I know he can sleep. Mm mm, that doll's eyes are open. It was not that. Why does he hear the sound in the hole? He better not stick his hand in there again. Ew, that's what it looks like he stuck his hand in there? That- <gasps> Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Give me back my heart! He took her- he ate her heart, bro. Nah, that's disgusting, man. Oh my god, run. Oh, no! Nah. Oh, no, wait, this is actually scary. Yo, she's about to pop up right in front of you, bro. Yo, oh! Fuck. Dang. God dang. Get up, man. Get up. Shit him, bro. That's what the heart beating was. Did she, did she take his heart? Oh my goodness. Fire. Fire. Stupidly good. You're telling me he ate a heart he didn't know it was a heart. He stuck his hand in a wall. You want something out of That's crazy he ate her heart, bro. That's crazy. Here we go. We have a Mickey Mouse short horror film. And why does this remind me of the Netflix and chill one? This looks kind of exactly like the same spot. Am I tripping? Camille, you gotta do this challenge, I dare you. I think it's the same channel. I think that's why. Hey, you'll be visited by Mickey. Bruh, what is this stupid challenge? Oh my god. <laughs> Comment down below and let us know, did you survive the Mickey Mouse challenge? Why did that scare me, man? Mickey Mouse challenge. I ain't doing that alone. It's not even funny. Like what? I'm just cur curiosity. I'm, why would I do it alone? If it's not true, I get nothing out of it. If it is true, I'm dead. Oh, it's glitching. Mm -mm. Bro. I oh, he's doing a whole bunch of loud noises, man. I can't whistle, so I wouldn't even be able to do the challenge. Oh, Mickey's coming for her. Mickey's coming for her. Can you get a hold of yourself? I survived the Mickey Mouse challenge. She really commented that. Um. Um. Someone took a bite out of Mickey's ear. Ooh. Oh. She's just dreaming. Is anybody there? 
she like there's no point in doing this alone. It's not like you're even funny. You're just alone. Hi, Sadie. Yes, Sadie, I tried this stupid challenge. No, nothing happened. But hey, I have to take a bath, so I'll call you tomorrow. Bro, you were just freaked out. Stay on the I phone. Stay on the phone. Like, what is this scent? Like, are those pink AirPods? No, she's really going to do it again. Why are he curling his fingers like that? Weird things have been happening since I did the challenge. Call me. Oof. Wait, weren't you just on the phone with her? Why didn't you just say that? Oh, Mickey's coming in. <laughs> Mickey wanted to take a bath with her. <laughs> now, who's whistling? That's him, right? Yeah, because she's under the water, drowning herself. Oh, the door is closed. We chilling, we chilling. But what? Why does she keep going underneath the water? Mickey's coming back in. She's dead this time. <gasps> oh, he's about to drown her. Wait. Okay, she's dead. Ew. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Let's be honest. All right, and for our final one, we got True Gas Station Horror Story by Mr. Llama Arts. Two years ago, 505,000 views. Let's play. True gas station. And then we got the new Llama Arts. One night last summer, two of my friends, Sam and Jake, convinced me to sneak out with them and drink. We were mm -hmm. all bored just looking for something to do. I like we video games to or go something. For a walk to a local gas station that was open 24 hours a day. The walk there was pretty uneventful. We talked about random topics and fun. drank a pretty couple chill. of beers. Once we got to the gas station, Jake had to use the bathroom. When he was in the bathroom, there was a dirty, sketchy guy in there. Oh. Jake struck up a conversation with this guy. It was pretty normal, he just except when the guy asked why he was out so late and if he was by himself. Jake brushed it off as the guy was just trying to tell him to stay safe. We bought some snacks and we up. noticed the guy following us around while he was talking to someone on his phone. Well, the bag we left soon after and on the way back, we sat on the side of the road and talked for a while as we drank some more. It was pitch black mm -hmm. by now because there are no street lights in the area. I see a street light right there though. We saw a car coming down the road, which was no big deal. We sneak out pretty often and we've never had any real Ooh. problems. Cars usually just drive by. This time was different. Um, the car spun around in the road and pulled up right next to us on the street and two guys got out. Excuse me? We ditched the beers, got up, and sprinted down the street. Jake and I Thank hid you. behind an RV while Sam hopped a fence. Uh -oh. The two men looked dirty, like they hadn't showered in days. We watched the two guys for a little while, which is when we noticed that one of them had a gun in his hand. Nah. They looked in our direction for a few minutes before they got back into their car and drove off. Jake and I looked for Sam, but we couldn't find him. Bro, so we Sam decided dead. to head back home. We you guys just left lost Sam. Them. But on the way back, we turned a corner, and those same guys were oh, sitting in the car, shoot. waiting there. We ran through the alleyways Get and backyards Sam. until we lost them. Every few minutes, we saw the car driving slowly down a street or alleyway in the distance, and we would hide. Llama Cafe. Eventually, we made it back, and Sam messaged to tell us that he got okay. followed by a different car, oh. but he made it home safe. It's been almost a year since that night. Dang, everyone's We're always out there more then. cautious when we go out, and Sam still has nightmares about being abducted. I don't know for sure if the guy from the bathroom had anything to do with it. But we believe that he's somehow mm. connected to it. 
Makes sense, makes sense. Apparently this one's true too. <laughs> this one is true too. All right, well, there you go. Those are five horror short videos, including the Man of the Adventure 2 trailer. I think I did way better this time than last time. We actually got some scary ones and some really good stories. If you ever want to recommend a video for me to react to, make sure to join the Discord server, go to the horror videos category, and then drop the video you want me to react to. If you guys like the video, make sure you hit the like. If you guys dislike the video, make sure you hit the dislike. And subscribe if you like this type of content. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.